Good afternoon. Today is Tuesday, October 13th. And I was like, Nikki, you don't be doing anything that you could start like vlogging because I mean, I don't know, maybe it'll make me get in the mood to want to do things, you know? So right now I'm chilling. I have my bonnet on because I washed my hair yesterday and I'm not planning on doing anything with my hair. I have some acne spot treatment on that I'm still kind of testing out. I started using it like a few weeks ago, but I haven't been consistent. So I'm trying to use it to see if I like it and if it's going to help when I have like breakouts or just really stubborn pimples. And if so, I'm going to do a video on it because I'll be searching and scrambling the internet for like, you know, help with dark spots and pimples that are just really stubborn and just, uh. so trying things out. But I'm just chilling today. I'm going to study a bit for my permit test. Yes, I'm growing out on my permit. Life happens, whatever. But we're getting there. We're, you know, we're getting there. I take it this week, like later on. Kind of anxious, but um, I am also like anxiously excited to just start driving. Because like I'm tired of being home. <laughs> like, I'm tired of it tired of like I don't know it's like I I feel like I'll be able to do more things on my own time as I should have been but like I said life happens but you know we're finally at a good spot I'm tired as hell I could not sleep I was watching The Haunting of Hill House such a good show I would totally recommend especially for like the spooky season really good I'm gonna probably watch The Haunting of Bly Manor and if I do I, I kind of started it but I wasn't paying too much attention so I might like restart it but if I do I'll show y'all when I'm doing that because I probably do it at night because I like doing these things at night and then I'm like oh my god can't sleep because like scared you know but yeah I may edit a video today I'm not sure I'm kind of just like watching videos and relaxing but I really want to focus on studying because I've already read the book twice front page to back page but I want to make sure that I'm really inputting the information into my brain so that when they ask me questions I'm not like we uh, I am planning I think two more Halloween videos well technically three more because I have one going up tomorrow the 14th um, Wednesday the 14th so excited for that video I've already started sharing about it like on my Instagram because I wanted to um, see I'm kind of testing out like how promotion works and stuff because sometimes I just post and like don't promote so I'm testing out stuff but um I'm going to be posting that video on the 14th so by this by the time this vlog is up that'll be posted and then I have another idea that I'm gonna do I got some wings from ASOS it's not like chicken wings not like fairy butterfly wings those are two different things butterfly wings something like that and I plan on doing a video on that because I kind of like put like a whole costume together around it so I think that'll be fun and then I'm gonna be doing Winnie the Pooh because your girl is a Winnie the Pooh queen okay I've had this Pooh bear for like 17 18 years so it's just a special thing but I love Winnie the Pooh so I wanted to create like a cute little makeup look to go with my Winnie the Pooh outfit because I'm chilling, I'm staying in, and I'm gonna be in my Pooh Bear onesie watching scary movies because that's who I am, eating my Whole Foods snacks. It's just like a chill day. I kind I'm gonna go downstairs and like cook a little bit later, but yeah, hopefully I'm like in my mind, like I have like so many things running through my mind. I hope that I'll be able to get in a cooking video this month because um, I'm... It's just something I've become a little bit more passionate about, like healthier meals, healthier cooking, just better things for my body. So I wanted to share that with you guys, but hopefully I get that in. But I've just been tired because like I said, I haven't been sleeping. Like I literally got like three hours of sleep. So yeah, but um, yeah, that's just what I'm doing. I'm currently watching a weekly vlog in Aaliyah's face vlog because um, I'm avoiding studying. But I should probably get to studying. So I might do that. But yeah, so I'm just going to watch YouTube, study, do a little bit more laundry. I only have a little bit left. And then, yeah, so that is my day for today. Kind of chill, 
not taking a nap because Miss Girl. <laughs> you need to sleep at night, not during the day. But anyways, so yeah, I'm gonna get to like studying. Okay guys, so today is Wednesday, October 14th. It's 10, 11 in the morning. I have plans basically like later on today, but today is gonna be like a chill study day for me, but I wanted to get ready now because I just got out the shower. I'm fresh, I'm shaved, I'm feeling good. So yeah, I'm just going to do my hair, do my makeup and vibe. I'm putting together my playlist for November because I do them like throughout the previous month that makes sense i already posted my october playlist link will be up here if you guys haven't seen that yet if you guys are interested and get ready for my day real fast you guys are gonna see me do it in like two seconds but it's gonna take me like 30 minutes but yeah so let's just go and get ready Okay, so that is my makeup. Oh, girl, I forgot to set. Hold on. That is my makeup for the day. I wanted to do something light but pretty. I did a different technique today and I really liked that. I might do a whole tutorial on it because I didn't use that many products. I didn't use too much of the products that I would normally use and I actually really like it. But uh, this is my perfume of the day. This has been my favorite for years. This is the Tommy Bahama Very Cool. It's a body mist. So good. I'm using my favorite deodorant. One of my favorites is the Secret Page Bound Shower Fresh. Amazing. But yeah. So I'm going to go study. And then we'll see. I probably, I probably want to study up until lunch. 10 30 i eat lunch around like one so i might want to study up until then even though my distracted probably won't but um we're gonna put it into the universe to see if we can do it i like the way i did my edges today i tried a different technique than i normally do because i've been watching videos and i was like oh that's why they're not coming out like all that cute so simple look just have carmex on my lips some mascara light foundation light concealer as y'all saw i mean i was speeding through but y'all saw so yeah i'm gonna get to studying so i'm gonna show y'all a little bit of that and we're gonna continue on y'all ever hear a song and be like eh it's okay probably wouldn't listen to it again or you probably would and then you listen to it again and you're like oh i was asleep that's how i feel about that megan Thee stallion and young thong young thong Girl, Young Thug song, Don't Stop. It's fire. I love me some Megan Thee Stallion, but when I first heard it, I was just like, I don't know. Like, I liked the music video and everything. And that's what made me, like, really, like, vibe with the song. But I was like, I don't think I'll download it. But I would watch the music video again because shit was flame. And the entire time I just did my makeup, I was listening to the song on repeat. So we see on a pat. We see a pattern on my channel where I don't like a song sometimes and then the next day I play it all day and then it's one of my favorite songs and it's a part of my playlist coming soon so yeah we love a difficult queen huh no we don't anyways I'm out to study from a little license whatever Guys probably like Nikki, oh my god, you're 20, yeah, whatever. Life happens and not everybody gets their stuff. Um not everybody gets their stuff around the same time. So I mean I've learned to just accept it and accept that life has this is an inspirational speech. I've learned to accept that life has like roadblocks, so everything that I thought would happen at a certain time didn't. Cause life was like so yeah not every not everybody um you know 
gets their stuff at the same time. But I'm here and I'm doing it. And yeah. <sighs> so today, because I have the book, so today basically what I'm going to be doing is um, doing practice tests. I started doing them last night, but I um, was always like studying the book but now I'm gonna just keep doing practice tests and then I'm gonna study the book one more time because I've read it like two or three times and then yeah I'm gonna take like a few practice tests I'm yeah you know I don't know I'm figuring it out I'm nervous as hell because I just I don't know I'm the type of person like oh my god it's gonna I know the right answer but because I'm taking the test and see other answer choices I'm like okay well I saw this in the textbook somewhere but girl just because you saw it somewhere doesn't mean it related to the question but we know this is called test anxiety so yeah but I'm what the, oh. but I'm gonna study a bit and then yeah so Okay, so I passed this test. It says I have to pass at least 20 te tests to get like 80% readiness. So for me to be deemed as like ready to go, just so that like I'm confident, whatever. So do I want to take another one right now? I think I'm going to take one more, or at least start one more um, and see how I do. And then take a break and then... Um, I'll get back to you guys. So I'm gonna be studying like a scholar. Uh, can't wait to just get this, get this over with. But it's important to know the rules and stuff of the road. So. Passed again. I'm not sure what the hell is going on with this little website because I'll get the question right, but it tells me I got it wrong. But I know that I got it right because I'll like look it up afterwards, like to check my work when it tells me I got it wrong so I'm not sure like if it's taking like you know when you change your answers like you can like unselect one and choose another I'm not sure if it's like counting the first answer that I put so I'm just gonna try again and be more careful even though I've passed these um two practice tests that I just took I just want to make sure because it's really weird I, I don't know why it's doing that it's quite annoying we're gonna figure it out but yeah I'm hella tired I would take a nap but no because we did our makeup and it's actually cute and we have plans so we're not taking a nap even though I'm tired but yeah so on my Instagram, um, I like to post reels and IGTVs on Fridays normally but today I posted one because I'm putting up a video today and I just thought it was a good idea to make a reel out of it so it's the Aaliyah inspired makeup tutorial I'm so proud of myself I'm so happy about it and it goes up today at 2 p.m. so when you guys are seeing this video it already be up um, I had so much fun like recreating that look and putting the outfit together and like everything and so to see all the love also like on my Instagram and you know everything and I guess, you know, almost people recognizing not only like your, your talent, but your effort, it it gives me a nice warm feeling because I've wanted to recreate that look for years and years since I was little. I was like, I want to look like that one day. I don't know how, but I want to. And then I was finally able to and finally confident in myself to know that I would do the look justice. So I'm very happy and proud of myself. Um, yeah. So that video is going up today at 2 p.m. I edited it. I feel like edited it's such a, I'm probably pronounced edited it. Anyways, I edited it, <laughs> edited, edited it, edited it. I edited it. <laughs> and um, it's going up today at two on my channel. And I just posted the reel on Instagram. It's like 11. So I don't care to check. It's a lamb sum. And yeah, so today will be consisting of basically promoting that video, I guess. And 
studying, so. And then going to the pool because like, we deserve to decompress, you know? If you put your mind at work all day, you deserve to decompress, you know? You deserve it, so. That's gonna be my day for today. So, of course, I have the Queen's, you know, post notifications on. And she decided to say, this woman right here, okay, right here, she has an album coming later this month. Later this month, bitch, it is October 14th. There's 15 days. <laughs> oh! 16 days left of this month. 15? There's 15. No, there's 17. Girl, math, not her. There are days left in this month, and Ariana Grande said, I'm dropping, and I'm gagged. I'm happy. I want to cry. Um, <laughs> it's like, okay. <sighs> Anyways. I had to say, cause girl, I, gagged. Girl, I almost choked on my, woo! She's coming. I just made lunch and, you know, I was so into it and plus I was so shook by like the Ariana Grande news that I um forgot to record it and it was a nice wrap, but one of these days this week, I'll hopefully um, record it because I do make them pretty often like for lunch and I do want to do a separate video on that like I said I want to also like health and wellness videos and the recipes that I use or try my best to use are <laughs> why is my voice cracking I'm too happy um are more on the low carb low calorie side kind of so um I want to like show that of course for anyone who's interested because your girl's becoming a chef okay 2020 came and they said, Nicolette, you're gonna become a chef. And I said, okay, and here I am making good food because what I've said, bomb. I'm going to make hamburgers tonight for me and my girl. She's coming over. So um, my mom was thinking of making hamburgers, but I'm like, girl, I can do it. Like I can do it. So, I mean, I've never made hamburgers, but like, we're gonna see how it goes. But um, yeah. Ariana Grande is coming, my edges are slayed. I really like the way I did my edges today, like wow. This is the first time I actually used that brush properly. Um, yeah, so, not me thinking I was doing my edges cute this whole time and I didn't even use the brush properly the way I'm supposed to. Anyways, I received great music from the one and only Ariana Grande. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, I, I'll be reacting to it on my channel, so I guess in the next two weeks, expect the Ariana Grande. <laughs> I saw I'm gonna cry. Expect the Ariana Grande album reaction, AG6. And I I was so happy. I just did five laps around my kitchen. So Ariana, thank you so much for the um, motivation to do some cardio. I'm tired now. So, yeah, I think I'm going to watch some Haunting of Bly Manor because I don't have nothing. To, I mean, I should be studying, but I, my brain needs a damn break. Um, so I'm going to watch some Haunting of Bly Manor. I guess I'll let you guys know because I'm definitely going to finish it. I think I only have like four more episodes. I will say for this season, I feel like it's taking so much longer. It's taking so much longer to like get to the point. I don't know. I feel like Haunting of Hill House, like... I don't know. Maybe it's because I just saw it and like it really set my expectations like all the way up here. Like that was like a 9 out of 10 type. 10 out of 10? No, 9 out of 10. So, but I'm not minding this one. So far, I'd probably give it like a 7. I don't know. Maybe I'm not paying attention enough, but I DK. I feel like it's really going to get me good in the last episode and I'll be like, damn, wish I paid attention. So. What does it mean when... <laughs> Your orchids are falling off. Is the plant dead? Cause my orchid, all right. The little, st it keep coming off. And I have, I started off with five and there's one. I'm watering it once, once or twice a week because orchids shouldn't be watered so much. And sunlight is indoor sunlight. So through a window, either it have curtains or, so I'm, 
what a vlog, right? My plan is dying. Why does it, hold on. Hey Siri, why do my orchids keep falling off? Hmm, I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? Why do my orchid flowers keep falling off? Okay, I found this on the web for why do my orchid flowers keep falling off. Check it out. Hold on, you tell me my plant is that I just got her. Hold on, I've been a very good plant mom. I'm offended. Hold on. Hold on, my orchid. No, I thought I was playing. My orchid dead ass die. I'm offended. Um, I have one bud left. Okay. Okay, I'm offended. I'll be back later. So I got some things from Fashion Nova. When I say things, I literally mean two things. The first is this like bodysuit. I've had bodysuits. I never had a Fashion Nova. Oh my God, this quality. <gasps> Ooh. Okay, cute. And it's really stretchy. This is their voted most likely bodysuit in medium. Maybe I'll do a mini try on haul because I want to try these on to make sure. I never use the coupon codes that they sent me. I should. I'll be trying to find bigger ones, like bigger codes. And then I got this because it really was cute to me. Um, you're going to see. So this one looks bigger even though it's a medium. It's crazy. But it's light blue and it has like the chain thingies on it. It's really, it's really cute. So I'll try those on for you guys. Um, I think tonight, I don't know. I don't have much to do. Let me show you guys. I'm literally like filming everything or day two day two I have these wings that I got Ooh. oh I have these wings that I got from ASOS and isn't it called something else no it's ASOS and um I want to create like a butterfly look based on the color scheme of the wings. So it's like gray and black and that's why I got the black bodysuit. Um, Cause I thought it'd be a cute Halloween costume, like a cute butterfly on the low. So I want to film it tonight, but then at the same time, what the hell am I going to do tomorrow? But then it's like, if I do do something tomorrow, my makeup's going to be all like butterfly like, like that's like weird, right? Not really, I don't know. I'm watching The Haunting of Blind Manor right now. And yeah, so I just unboxed those. I think I want to try them on. So I'm going to play the show and I'm going to show you guys like what they look like on. Um, so that I know that they fit me or not. I feel like a medium might be a little too big. Because I have been a small for a while now. But I feel like I'd fit good into a medium. But I'm not sure. The way that blue one's looking, I don't know. But we'll see. So I'm going to try them on. And then we're gonna see. Wait, I don't know if this is an appropriate, but I've tried on bathing suits, so it's like the same thing. This is so comfortable. This is so cute and so comfortable. Oh my. And the medium's fine. I honestly, I don't know. I think it's fine. I could have gotten a small. It's not tight at all, and I have room, but the medium is so comfortable. I think it's gonna really wash well. Fashion Nova, girl. All right. I gotta be careful, but let me try on the other one because the other one is like more dressy and more like, eh. but this is cute. They have it. They have this one in like multiple colors. So, okay, next item. Okay, so I put on these burgundy shorts with them because I did not feel like finding um, other shorts because these are what I could find. But oh my God, this is so comfortable. This is also in a size medium and I really could have sized down, but I like the sizing because it doesn't feel too big, but it's not too tight. If I sized down, it would have been like too perfect almost. And I think that this is the perfect size even for being safe with washing and everything because things can shrink. This one is so comfortable. This one feels like more of like a 
cottony material and I love it. This one's definitely like bigger size than the other one if that makes sense but navy blue I love this color and I love this color scheme. I don't know I feel so confident in it you know I get I would get nervous when it came to bodysuits because I'm like oh my god it's gonna accentuate like my stomach and everything but no I feel hella confident and I feel like that B word so uh copy some Ooh, hold on copy some Fashion Nova uh, bodysuits because I think these were the first ones that I've ever tried but that black one something different and I love the little v-neck it's not too deep so I think I'll order those in more colors because I have a lot of colors like basic colors like white beige gray and that and I'll do that so yeah I'm going to study so I'm gonna study and finish The Haunting of Blind Manor because I don't have anything else to do. I was thinking of, I don't know, I may film, I may not, I don't know. We'll see. If I do, I will end up showing you guys the final look. But yeah, so it is 10.55 p.m. I'm gonna study one more time tonight and then just watch my show and kind of chill, so. Yeah. Damn, my little towel holder is the perfect freaking tripod but okay excuse my hair girl with hair anyways i am oh it's in the shower i am going to be taking off my makeup um it is like 11 55 p.m but i don't know i'm using my palms cold cream makeup remover I love this stuff, it really gets deep into your skin and gets your makeup and also leaves your skin feeling really flip and soft, so especially if you do heavy makeup, I feel like this would be appropriate. My makeup today was so light, I didn't even use as much makeup as I normally do, so I didn't really need to do this, but I'm doing it because I feel like filming another video, my butterfly. Halloween video, but I mean, it's freaking about 12 a.m. But I get inspiration when I sleep. Like I have an idea of what I want to do in my head. It's nothing crazy, but I just thought the look was really cute and affordable and like good last minute, but I don't know. I kind of want to, I'm feeling inspired to. This is what my skin is looking like tonight. I don't know, I think I want to film it. So if I film it, I will show you guys what I look like. Hey, so Donald and Kamani agree that I should film. So I am, if y'all watching this, it's your fault that I am not sleeping. Just kidding, but. So I think I'm gonna film. So you're gonna see me look completely different, but like, mind your business, period. So I think I'm gonna film it. But I'm gonna finish watching this episode and then I'm gonna film it. So sister told me to do it too. So I guess we're turning into a butterfly right now. Ah! Mom literally texted me like, Nicolette, nice and sweet makeup, nice and simple. Like, as if I don't know that. So I just was like, you know, I'm going all out. As if I'm gonna just be doing like the Aaliyah look, you know, again. Girl, I know. When she'll she me see me, she'll be happy. This is the fit, like it matters. Like anybody's gonna see this, but. I'm nervous. I have to sneeze. Okay. I'm on my way Audi, so I'll be back. Home now and ah! I'm vlogging. I'm home now and I'm trying to make like a cute like DIY decor for my room for fall so I put these little bollies in here and this vase and then my mom um, tied a ribbon on it. Thank god for her talent because I couldn't do it. This headband is from Dollar Tree too. It's actually kind of crazy. All this stuff is from Dollar Tree and we have these and I'm going to see if they look good in the vase so and I have these Asuka, candle holders, so I'm trying to decorate my room somewhat for the fall because it is my favorite season, regardless. So, but yeah, I'm gonna try and finish this vase and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so boom. So since the last clip, obviously I had my hair on, but I just tried a, 
Um, I just tried, I filmed a video just now. If my hair looks a mess, then that's why you guys will see that video. I'll have it in the cue cards in the description. So, I went to the DMV or whatever, right? I was on question 50. And I got a little cocky, I'm not gonna lie. And I just, you know, I bombed it on the last question, okay? The last question. Do you hear me? The last question. It was so frustrating. I told myself I'm going to go home and prep some more and then go back because, you know, to sit there and continuously take the test and pay every time. They're just taking my money, sweetie. Oh, my God. These products did nothing for my hair. Don't go to Dollar Tree for curly hair products. Anyways, at least we found out together. But, you know, it, it was a learning experience because, you know, during the last few questions, I got really cocky because of how far I got. And then all of a sudden, I bombed it. And I was like, damn, I didn't think that that could happen. You know, I got a little too cocky. So I have confidence in myself. But, you know, I have to, you know, remain humble and stay calm. You feel me? Because then, you know, stuff like that kind of blows up in my face so it was kind of like a lesson that I think that I needed to be taught um because I got really cocky in my head like I'm not gonna fly I mean there was no one I could say it to but in my head I'm like bro you dead and I started guessing on because I was like bro like you know you got this and I had it but then you know I let my focus go because I got so cocky you feel me and that obviously didn't work out in my favor so you know always stay focused you know and just be yourself and yeah so but i am gonna schedule it for soon because i think that you know this experience also helped me you know learn what would be on the test and what's really really important or what they really want to know so i'm gonna study a bit more i'm gonna schedule my appointment first so i know because i just want to get it over with um i feel like i have the information fresh in my head so that i should i should um you know schedule it sooner but so i'm gonna spend the weekend because today is friday by the way i'm gonna spend the weekend studying so this is the setup i have so far i have this snoopy pumpkin he's dressed in a pumpkin i have a pumpkin pumpkin and then i have the vase that my mom and i just created with the plants the bow and the little balls on the inside i really like it i think it looks cute i'm probably gonna change where it is but um, for now, I wanted to put it there just to see how it goes with my room and where I want to put it. So if I change it, I'll let you know. But this is like the beginning of me, you know, decorating my room for fall a little bit. Nothing too crazy. Like I just, you know, I had the pumpkin before and now I think that's like the cutest thing. So I might want to move it next to my diffuser on the other side, but we'll see. Okay, so it's still, what day is it? Oh, it's Friday, October 16th. I um, just purchased from Ulta and Amazon. I'm not spending any more money. I need to save for the holidays, but um, I'm eating an apple and my hair. I still have, I did a Dollar Tree hair product video. Um, a mess. So I'm gonna get off this joint, but I never say that this joint. But yeah, I'm relaxing, I'm chilling, I'm cooling thinking of video ideas um about to edit one that i filmed earlier so like so so yeah videos coming your way this fall this winter this the rest of the year period because we're grinding and the grind doesn't stop apparently good morning today is october 17th and i want to work with this wig but i want to make it like a wet look don't know if you can do that with synthetic wigs, but I'm gonna try because I'm just gonna wash it and soak it and then, you know, put styling products in it when it's really damp. So, yeah, this is this synthetic wig. So, I don't know if it works with synthetic hair, but today I'm chilling. It looks nice outside, as you can see the glare. So, I'm gonna go for the swim or just try and tan because the girl is pale, but I'm just gonna fill my sink up with some water. Let's see the wig. You know, I got this um, conditioner from Dollar Tree, the VO5. 
I don't know how, what it's gonna do exactly for a wig, but I wanna try it because I didn't like it on my hair. I don't know. So I'm gonna see what it's gonna do. So I'm just gonna put that. It just came out like water, like ew. Oh, whatever. But I'm gonna just put that like in the water with the wig to kind of condition it and soften it to see what it does. I mean, if it ruins it, then it was meant to be ruined. But I don't know, I did this with other conditioner and it was fine, so I think it should be fine, but. Yeah, today is a chill Saturday. I don't plan on putting on any makeup, but if the wig comes out the way I want it to, then I'm probably gonna film because like, I think the wet curly look is so cute, but I don't know, it depends. Like, you know when you like do your hair, you have an idea of your hair, and then you're like, oh, this makeup would be cute with it. Like, that's how I'm feeling right now, so that's why I did this. But we'll see, so yeah. What I think I'm gonna do though, is I'm gonna leave the top part out, like, that's gonna go over my head, because I'm, I don't know. I don't want it to be like soaked on my head. I don't know. I'm trying things out, I'm learning. So she's soaking. I want to see. She's soaking. It, it had product in it. That's why I had a little bit of my makeup on the top. But yeah, this is our morning skin. I did just wash my face using my Cetaphil All Skin Types Cleanser. Because I did fall asleep with my makeup on because I was editing. But yeah, so chill day today. This is the video that I edited or and put up today. Styling my curly hair with so only Dollar Tree products. So... I'm gonna see how that video does and everything. I'm just watching it to make sure that I really didn't make any errors. Should probably do that before publicizing it, but. Look at mommy. My fit of the day. Going out. Yeah. Period. Fashion over top, bottoms, snobbelicious glasses. I forgot where I got these earrings from. Say hey. Hey. <laughs> hey, what's up? Yeah. It's it's big hack and sack in the cut. And yeah, we're going to the outlet mall and yeah, daddy daughter day basically. So, don't you like these glasses? Mm -hmm. Very bougie. <laughs> it's gotta show out, you know? The other ones. Which ones? The ones that you gave me? Wow. <laughs> My dad keeps forgetting his mask. <laughs> but, that's when get some cheesecake and um, you know shop with our eyes I'm now home and I'm tired. My feet are sore, but I want to show you guys the shoes that I got, like a close up. I really, really like them. These are them. They're called the W Air Max 200. Oh, come on, he was right there, Air Maxes. But yeah, they're really super comfortable. I'm going to try them on to make sure, but I like how you can kind of like put it with a lot of colors. Obviously, not just any color, but you know quite a lot so I really like them I think they're clean bro so these are my new babies hee <laughs> hee Ariana Grande's post notifications on because I mean 
and she put a link to her website. I said, what is this? Miss the girl, what is this? I click on it. Album in two weeks, positions in one week. Please, life is made reaction videos coming soon. Ah, oh, I'm so happy with my girl. I look a mess right now. I don't know, I don't like when I do dark eyeshadow too, too much. I don't know, but yeah, I'm gonna decompress and chill, but I had to let y'all know that my girl is coming and y'all can't stop her. <laughs> Good morning. Today is Sunday, October 18th. So today I'm going out with the fam a little bit. I, to show, I just did my makeup and my hair mind it i wanted to show you guys my perfume so my perfume is tori birch love relentlessly so it smells so good i love the roller so yeah my outfit is this all white and yeah i'll show you guys like the full fit when i'm done So that is it for this vlog i hope you guys enjoyed if you get if you did don't forget to like this video comment down below and subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in the next one let me know if you guys really like these weekly vlogs because it was kind of fun doing it and it's fun to document you know doing things so let me know and i will see you guys in my next one bye